Hey there! In this video, I will show you how to build and install custom home environments on Quest 2. Now, this is not a tutorial on 3D modeling, but rather I will show you the workflow of creating your own custom home files and installing them onto your Quest. So, for example, if you've developed a game and you want to create a custom home to go with it but don't know where to start, this video is exactly what you need. You'll be using two free tools. First, you will need Blender to prepare and export your GLTF files in the correct format. GLTF a file is your 3D scene with models, basically a prepared home model that we will turn into a custom home. Second, you will need the most recent version of the environment converter. This will convert and build your custom homes into APKs. Both of these programs are free and you can download them by following the links in the description. To begin, download and open the environment startup scene in Blender. You'll find a download link in the description below. You can see that this startup scene includes visualizations of the Oculus menu and the new teleport location points. This gives you an indication of how your home will look and perform in the headset. Then import your GLTF file by going to File, then Import and GLTF 2.0 and select your file. This GLTF file is my existing home model that I will work with. Once imported, you must make sure that the object is centered around the origin of the Blender scene. As you can see, I'm moving the object so that the center point of the grid is positioned nicely over the seat. This will ensure that the player will be spawned in the correct position. You also want to make sure that the floor of your home is lower than the teleportation points so that the player can see them when trying to teleport in the headset. Once you have the objects prepared, select the entire scene except for the startup object objects. You don't want to select the menu, avatar, and teleport locations. Then go to File, Export, GLTF 2.0. From here, you need to navigate to the Build folder of the Environment Converter. On the drop-down box on the right, set the file format to GLTF Separate. Then open the Include drop-down tab and make sure that the option Selected Objects is checked. Again, this will ensure that we exclude the startup assets. Finally, give your object a name and after this, you are ready to export. When the scene is finished exporting, open the Environment Converter. Here you will see a number of settings and options that you can play around with. You can edit things like the app and package name, or even add custom audio to your home. To add a custom audio track, you simply export your audio as an OGG file, then drag and drop it onto the Converter window. Once it's finished processing the audio, press Create two releases with and without audio. A window will pop up which will allow you to give your home a name. After that, press Save. The Converter will automatically build your APKs into an archive. I prefer to move them to a specific folder before unpacking one of the APKs to an accessible location. And finally, you can build and install your custom home APK on your Quest directly from the environment converter without any extra steps, which is really cool. Simply make sure that your Quest is connected to your PC and the developer mode is enabled and press build and install environment. After a short building process, you will be notified and your home will be installed on your Quest. Put on your headset and navigate to settings, personalization, scroll to the bottom and select your custom home. And now you are using your custom home environment. If you want to share your home with others, you can simply submit your APK to SideQuest and create a new listing. We want to give a huge shout out to the Quest Homes team. Thank you for making all of this possible. Make sure to join their Discord for lots of custom homes and for more resources for developers. You'll find the link to their Discord down below. We at SideQuest are so excited to see what custom homes you will create, so make sure to share them. Thanks for watching and happy SideQuesting!